Hello Sporters! Welcome to Endless Sport Time. The NFL is no different from any other sports leagues, when it comes to star power, and how the promotion players. They use approaches like choosing who to push as the face of the league. Players like Patrick Mahomes, are pushed for this skills on the field, and Tom Brady, is pushed because of his bigger market, due to his popularity, and career. However, there are many players who are never pushed by the NFL, or their fans. For various reasons, these players didn't get the respect they deserved on the football field. Here are 10 players, who had a quietly great career. 10. Mark Bolger Mark Bolger was one of the great forgotten figures of the early 2000s, remembered all the way, when Kurt Warner left Ram, but no one remember who replaced him. It was a young Bolger, from West Virginia, who took over the Hall of Fame his league's second year. Despite being a six-round pick, Bolger immediately proved his worth as a player. He played multiple Pro Bowl seasons in his nine years with St. Louis. However, his career quickly declined after leaving the Rams. He retired in 2011, after one year as a backup in Baltimore. 9. John Kondo. Long snappers never gets love, which makes sense. They have a unique task, which is kicking the ball to punter or kicker on special teams. They enter the field few times in each game. However, some long snappers like, John Kondo, made the most of his time on the field. Kondo has been the league's most consistent long snapper, for nearly 15 years. He made the Pro Bowl twice in his long career. 8. Kyle Vandenv. Kyle Vandenv, is an interesting case of a player. He was a big league player, and was a physical, and strong defensive end, who played for over 10 years. However, he didn't get much respect from the fans. Fortunately, he won several prizes in the league. He made three Pro Bowl appearances, while playing with the Tennessee Titans, from 2005 to 2009. He retired from the sport in 2013. 7. Brian Orikbo. Brian Orikbo was a monster when he was on the D-line during his time in the league. The Texas graduate was drafted by the Washington Redskins in 2009, where he dominated. During his six seasons with D.C., he was selected to three Pro Bowls, Orekpo left Washington in 2014, to sign with the Titans. There, he was selected to another Pro Bowl team. He retired in 2018, after playing 10 seasons in the league. 6. Trent Green Trent Green is another great player who was forgotten in the 1990s, and early 2000s. He started as a substitute for Kurt Warner in St. Louis in 2000, when the Rams won the Super Bowl. But there's more to Green's resume than sitting on the bench to get a ring. Green's most memorable run outside of St. Louis was in Kansas City. There, he made two Pro Bowls in six seasons with the Chiefs uniform. 5. Tom Bahali The Kansas City Chiefs are now a contending dynasty team, but many fans forget how terrible they used to be. Many players have suffered from this problem, but not as much as Tom Bahali. Holly played 12 seasons for the Chiefs. During that time, he was named to six Pro Bowl and two All-Pro teams for his destructive work as linebacker. Hello guys! If it's your first time here, and so far you find this content interesting. Don't hesitate to press the subscribe button, and turn on the notification bell. So that you'll be alert each time, we post a new video like this. So far so good, let's continue. 4. Paul Pizlozny Paul Pizlozny was drafted by the Buffalo Bills in 2007 with high expectations. But he didn't really reach his prime for another three years until he left New York for the Jacksonville Jaguars in Florida. Pizlozny spent seven seasons with the Jags, he was one of the best linebackers in the league. During this time, Jacksonville was so poor that, he didn't win many awards, and were drawn to only one Pro Bowl. 3. Derek Johnson Derek Johnson has been Tom Bahali's partner for the Kansas City Chiefs defense, for over a decade. From 2005 to 2017, he was one of the best defenders in the league, and was tough to play against. Although the Chiefs didn't win many games, Johnson made it difficult for opposing offensive players. Johnson was selected to four Pro Bowls, and two All-Pro teams while at KC. He retired in 2019, after playing one season in Oakland. 2. Marks Colston Marks Colston has had nearly every New Orleans Saints receiving records, and they had some amazing pass catchers walk through their door. He was Drew Brees' top target for most of his career. However, unlike the future Hall of Famer, he did not receive much recognition. In fact, Colston has no awards other than the Super Bowl ring. Despite having nearly 10,000 receiving yards, he was not selected to a single Pro Bowl, or All-Pro team, 
in 10 seasons in the league. 1. Steven Jackson Steven Jackson had the misfortune of playing for St. Louis Rams from 2004 to 2012. During that time, he was the league's best runner back. The team was so bad that, no one noticed. Jackson was named to multiple Pro Bowls, and all Pro teams, during his season with the Rams. He worked briefly in Atlanta, and New England, before retiring in 2016. Alright guys. This is all I have for today. If you think I left out something, don't hesitate, to drop it in the comments section down below. Also, if you find this video interesting, give the video a thumbs up, and subscribe to the channel, for more videos like this.